All right, everyone, day one of Rocky Mountain Race Week. Got Clyde loaded up. Trailer's there. Go meet up with my dad and get the Buick. Head to Denver. You ready for this? I'm ready. Well, here we are. Clyde's ready to rock and roll and the Buick's ready to go, so we're gonna hit the road. So now you're cruising along the open road. Couple uh, streetcars pulling trailers. All right, so we made it, what, about probably an hour? What are we looking like? <laughs> looking like about what half tank, a little less than. What's your gauge showing right now? Twenty, but it only starts at seventy-five percent. So okay. That, that right there showing about a quarter tank, ain't it? Yeah, a little know. more than. I'd say it's about half the tank. Maybe half. Yeah. So we've driven probably. What do you think? How many miles? It's been about an hour, so maybe sixty miles or something. So we probably get a little over 100 miles of tank, huh? Yeah. Is it doing better with the driving, or is there still, we could work on that a little bit maybe? No, it's a lot smoother right Okay, now. cool. Like it doesn't give me that surge at that certain, which we're not at the high RPM like we were. Right. When I wasn't pulling a trailer. Yeah, That's now it's got maybe a little different load on it and stuff too. It's definitely pulling more, you can feel where it pulls against the car. More. Yeah. Stuff, just doesn't free wheel as much. Yeah. Yeah, like you're, you're more into the throttle now to hold it to maintain it, which obviously makes sense. Got so, it. so that's gonna be the biggest thing as we figured last night, it's what, about eight usable gallons of fuel in this thing? Yeah. So there's not very much in the Buick, but he also is gonna carry five gallons with him. So he can add if we need it in between gas stops. But even at that, we should be able to get about a hundred miles, maybe 110 out of a tank, plus your five here. So, I mean, you probably go 150-ish. Yeah between yeah. tanks and stuff old Clyde back here I mean we could go almost the whole trip on one tank but uh so he'll have a little bit of a struggle just as far as we'll have to stop a little more consistently for fuel and yeah, stuff on that side but it. that's just kind of part of it anyway but not doing too too terrible then uh not as no. bad as we we're kind of figuring right about that so we're gonna go ahead top that off head up to uh Denver or are you even gonna top off you're just gonna keep going well, so then you end up low because he has to switch to the C16 at the track, so that's something that he's got to kind of play a game too on how much he wants to have in the tank. Yeah, because I got to be able to drain that, that into my spare jug into an empty. Yeah. So I don't so want to go in. You the don't track. want more than five in there when you roll into a track. Right. Yeah. Which I, I, I think I'm okay. I thought about filling up now just because I know we travel. Yeah. Just to see how many gallons it did use. Well, that's a good idea. idea. It's just how much I got to use. From that. <laughs> put into that or swap or put some into yours or something. Yep, I guess we could always uh, add some to the line, a little flight ski. So, got two different issues here. Doesn't hardly use any and uses a little extra and not a very big tank. But uh, we're going to go ahead and do this stuff and then we'll hit the road again. Grab it bad. It's enough that it's. I haven't quite made it there yet. What you got going on? It's well, rubbing. Since I pulled the sway bar. Yeah. It lets the rear end shift, so oh. when, I, when I turn to the right, it rubs the tire it on it. It comes in and rubs the side. Alrighty, here we go. You ready? I'm ready. Alright, time for our first pass. We got teched in. Everything's ready to go. We got our trailer sitting over here to the side, but April's going to make her first pass. She actually entered into the 12-0 class, so she's going to try to go as fast as she can all week. Then I entered into the 13-0, so I'll probably have to lift at each track a little bit and try to go for that 13-0 spot. It's a little different this year, but we both have different goals. Try to get the thing in the 11s, and then maybe just try to be competitive in our class. That'd be nice. Yep, all Look right. lifting. <laughs> so we're going to uh, head up there now. She's going to pull in the lanes, make her pass, come right back around, then I'll make my pass. Here she goes. First pass for race week. See what she does. Seven, not, not bad. bad. Not 1284 on the mountain. Last year, I think it went 138 up here. Yeah, so, well, yeah, just cleaning everything up, and it sounded all the shifts sounded good. It didn't sound like it fell on its face real bad or anything. 
Awesome. Alrighty, so she just made her first pass with 1284. So I'm just gonna lift probably 200 feet out, try to clip off a real low 13 second pass for my class. And then her class, she really won't be super competitive in with like a 128. But then later in the week, she should be able to get some better 120 times. But at least she can run the car out and just run it the way she knows and not try to like pedal it or anything. So I'm gonna try to pedal it, take that 12.8 info from her, try to go 13 O's for me. Are you ready? Ready to go. See what happens here. Try to go that 13. Got a lift. Got a lift, unfortunately. It's kind of weird, but try to go 13. Right here. Doug and Andy, the Nova had a few issues, and this is the new car that they went and picked up. Frickin' pristine. Hell yeah. New car. Looks good. from the other side Yeah, there's a little dense, but hey, gives it some character. Ooh, that new motion marquee or what? Don't be jealous. Gosh, dang. This thing is really not clean at all. It's a huge pile of shit. <laughs> yeah, most speed 97,000 miles you'll ever see. Yeah, it's a, it's a unit though. Uh, Wood grain driven. Dosh dang. Mahogany. Uh, <laughs> it's a luxury loaded. It's AC power, work? Uh, uh, very well. Very cool. That's perfect yeah. then. What else could you ask for? I think we, I, I'm being told we should be able to get to the 14s by then. That would be awesome. It's a goal. Yeah. You gotta have goals. You got to. Got her stickered up though. 
I mean, you probably make a pass in the rain and be good to go all seasons. Rain, rain, go away. As I drop my phone. You got close to another pass. And I can't lift to scrub off speed, so I guess we'll let it finish raining. And then we'll try to keep going. Yeah, 20% chance. 100% chance at 20% chance. Chasing down the wagon. There it goes. Come on. All right, 1266, 109. Now we got Doug. You <laughs> That's pretty good. It's up good air now. You went 12.80s earlier. No, it's 12.60. I got a lift and try to go 13s, but I'm going to try to. I can't. I just went 12.8s full time. So. You know there was a 12.8 class. I know, I know. I let off twice, scrubbed off 7 mile an hour, still went 12.8s. Oh, that thing dead hook. No, that's... It's dialed in. Definitely dialed in. <laughs> we'll be back after a moment. <laughs> Put in a motion race. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. 18 two. Looked at some of the data and stuff, and really, I mean, it didn't want a bunch of fuel, but it kind of gets into the state where Ollie's like trying to add and subtract a bunch. We went ahead and limited that, and then more or less same exact tuna. So he's gonna try that now. We'll see what it does here. Not too bad. 890s, not the 850s we're wanting, but at least it made a good clean pull, and we'll figure it out from there. I'm not sure he's going to want to make another pull tonight or not, or just head to the next track. All right, well, this is Jane's third pass, and he still hasn't been able to lift, so let's hope you can lift this one, on this one. I gotta use the brake. So get on the brake. Yeah, I'll have to get on the brake. You gotta at least get something in the Just place. let off and get the brake. Oh, the one on the left, not the one on the right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Out of that build two race table, Abel's over there taking some video. run we're, we're in the lanes again because James can't lift I lifted and I hit the brakes and it still went 1295 so I just 12 second machine not even trying <laughs> just being a savvy guy so uh, yeah thousand foot mark hit the brakes solid stay in the brakes all the way through the back not heavy but in it and it should get that 13031 maybe a 12 minute. No, we're, we need a, we need a 13. <laughs> I gotta get a 13 so I at least have something to go tomorrow. So I'll be overly aggressive if it's a one or two, fine. It's rough, trying to lift and get it up. Second pass went a, a 894 and a 163, I believe, a 164. So making headway, did a little bit more tuning. Tried to get up on the two step earlier. I'm, I'm obviously not holding the two step long enough. So it's part of racing. So I'm going to come out here and try to get up on the two 
step a little bit further, hit it, see if we can't both get it closer to the 850. That's going to be what we got. So. Okay. Let's see what we got. What's up, Ryan? Yo. It took me all day to get it, but we got it. We're gonna go turn this in, get her out for tomorrow. And that ended up going 866, so not too bad. I think your leader is like 56, so you're like a tenth off. So, probably like a tenth off of the field, but not too bad. Take that, roll the carny, and leave that same tune up in it. And you should, I mean, see where you're at with that. Well, a faster than I can. Then you can lift a little bit. Come back. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I think we're gonna be. Pretty close, pretty close. I think. It all depends on track, and everything else. Everything's good here. It's not a bad Who first day of race week. In the right lane. That's the gotta get to the hotel, and then we got a long ass drive tomorrow. A little touchy on. <laughs> all right, everyone. So we are all loaded up. Cars are ready to go. Just turned in our slips. Got our route. Looks like it's a super long route tomorrow, but we will go to the hotel, get some sleep, wake up early, and hit the road. So we will be back with you guys tomorrow. So if you want to see those videos, hit that subscribe button. See you next time.